Good morning. Today is January 30th, 2023. And uh, we're just riding out. We want to go to the lighthouse. Not this dinky little one. For a while, we thought this is the lighthouse. But actually, this isn't. There's actually a lighthouse atop the hill. So we're going to try and make it there today. Today, there's actually a surprising number of people that are still hanging around. We thought this place will be kind of a deserted, but that's not true. We just passed by some coffee shops and they were crowded. So we'll see how it goes. Well, we came to the top of the hill where the lighthouse is. And it's crowded. It's crowded, all right. I have no idea why. I thought today there will be nobody here being the Monday uh, after it's the second Monday after the death so why is this place so crowded everybody here retired what's the deal here all right let's check out the view is it worth the climb all the way up here that's the question Wow, there's a great, great view here. This tree is kind of in the way, but still, great view of the beach from this side. And even can see the Statue of Christ over there. Looks like not too far away. Only one or two hills away. Looking to the back, you get an even more amazing view of the place. Don't know where that lake is. Must uh, go and explore it at some point. And uh, this looked like the front, uh, the back beach area, because the Statue of Christ. So on over here, which divides the front and the back beach, and then turn around, you see the lighthouse. That's the lighthouse there. And this is the office, I guess, to the lighthouse. The sun is beating on us today, that's for sure. Walking up the steps to the lighthouse. Uh, a little bit tight. There are a lot of people here. Oh, this area opens up and there is even a shop or two here. Oh, that's a pretty nice area. Got some shade over there. And some area for you to sit down. Some benches. Place for to buy some ice cream and drinks. And then you can walk down. It's just a, a little ruin, some kind of structure down there, and a couple of different uh, stone outcropping. Maybe that's a little gun place for a gun, a cannon, or something like that. Days long gone. Hopefully it won't come back again. Yep. See some fishing boats out there in the ocean. So we are seated here on the hillside with a motorbike parked and we are having coffee. This cute little coffee shop by the side of the road. Pretty good place, lots of tables. This is a pretty big place actually, with multiple stories to take advantage of the hillside uh, terrain. And uh, got the nice uh, bathrooms. And uh, it's actually a huge place, very nice. And you can easily get a table with a view and uh, see the beach. Well, you can't quite see the beach, you can see the water. You can see the beach in some places, but uh, overall, it's a very nice cafe. 
Well, lots of people, that's for sure. Oh, okay. is as slow as it gets and uh, we are here to have Bangkok pretty good place to come obviously if you look at the crowd you see that everybody's eating the same thing so we are eating the same thing too it must be good so here are the fixings there's the green papaya I think Oh, that mango, not sure. And then the veggie. Next come the sugar cane juice. Food has arrived. It's pretty good. This is the best uh, Bangkok that we have uh, eaten around here. So it should be good. Lots of uh, green papaya for you to eat with uh, the herbs and big head of lettuce. And here's the nook mum with sugar cane juice to boot. So pretty good. We are done and it was good. So we'll be heading out. Just look at the crowd. It's non-stop coming in. All local young people. Why are we the oldest folks here? So, uh, here's what it looks like. The crowd is non stop. Just paid. All right, we are heading out. Looks good. Looks like the food is good. Everybody's having the same thing. It's a matter of you order large or small, and the large come with seven pieces, the small come with five pieces. Everything being equal. All right, the, uh, they got a little misting action going on here. This is the place, 35 for large, 30 for small, but for New Year, everything increased by 5,000. So here's the line of motorbike, and we are parked all the way over that side because the crowd is just so big. All right, we are done. Just drove by some random park. Not sure what this is about, but it's like wheat, uh, artificial wheat with LED lights, and uh, I guess signify harvest. Uh, not sure if this is for picture taking, for celebration, or what it is. But the sea of LED wheat. And even here, in the middle of the circle here, and all around, some kind of display. Pretty interesting. But that's all that is. There's no... Well, there is some, like, uh, poinsettias here. And some of this... Uh, Either chrysanthemum or mums here. I can't tell which. That's about it. And I guess people are behaving themselves and not messing this up by going in there. Interesting.
Well, we were looking for a restaurant for maybe tomorrow's dinner, Nyam Nung. However, it looks like we can't find it. So instead, we pass by this place and we are going to have us some Gambo Saurin. This place is called Coffee 06. So we're gonna just perfect as an open table. Yola. Okay, turn it around. Okay, Campbell, Sorin, Rồi một cái kem bơ sầu riêng rồi một cái bây giờ bên con đã sầu riêng rồi cô ơi. Có một kem bơ. Ok, một cái kem bơ. Rồi nhắc có kem nhắc có chả lắm. Well, we stop by for some durian. Unfortunately, they have they are out of durian. So we got some coconut ice cream and some avocado ice cream and that's the best we can have. A little bit unfortunate but still a great night to be out here. This place is uh, filled up, not a, not a seat left except for our seats.